Let's say plenty of people, they are happy for the street of Abuja on Tuesday as the Supreme Court declares Senator Hope Uzodimma as governor-elect of Imo State. The nation apex court rule say the March 19 governorship election inside Imo State, it no go well as the law take put them as they say vote from about 388 polling units in all day. And they got say me they add them to the vote tally of Senator Uzodimma. Now the seven-man panel MC Justice Kudirat Kekere a could stand for. Now he delivered the order give the Independent National Electoral Commission may they withdraw the certificate of return when they give Governor Emeka Ihedioha and may they give fresh certificate of return to Senator Uzodima for the grant say he win the elections. Well, first and foremost, that we have indicated at the end of the day, our position from beginning to this end has been that the case of Imo is very unique. It's different from all election petitions in Nigeria. Because whereas others were complaining about non holding of the election of the various units, Imo's election petition was about exclusion of votes from 388. Amounting to 213,695 votes. This has been the case. And we thank God Almighty today that the Supreme Court saw the point we are making. That it is not a complaint about units, but a complaint about collision of results. And that if the 213 votes, since 95 votes have been added, that it was Hope Uzodima who scored the highest number of votes and how the required to not spread. The Supreme Court has so pronounced, and we give all glory to God Almighty, who made it happen. We want to say that the God of Imo State has spoken. Yes. This evening, distinguished Senator Pope Uzadima yes. has finally been declared the elected governor of Imo State. Yes. This is a story that has been in the communities in Imo State that Hope Uzadima won the election. Manipulations, we lost the election. But now, today, the Supreme Court has finally declared, has looked at all the issues and has declared Hope Musadima the elected governor of Imo State. At this point in time, all we need to do is to 